is up you guys alpha male here we're back again with another castle clash video and in today's video guys we are going to be upgrading the queen herself spirit mage the hero that everyone wanted in the beginning of the game and it kind of you know you guys kind of sleep on spirit mage okay i'm gonna have to say that right now a lot of you guys sleep on spirit mage spirit mage is absolutely an amazing hero so we're gonna make this real quick you guys she is now finally gonna be with all my other heroes all my other evolved heroes is gonna be a nine star evolve so we're gonna get her up so what she's gonna be looking like is her damage is gonna shoot up a little actually so quite a decent amount it's gonna jump up from 5773 to 6151 HP is going to go up by about almost 2,000. It's going to go up for 38,070 to 39,750. Attack rate is going to stay the same, but the important part out of everything here is the movement speed. I'm looking at her at an arena point of view. The movement speed is going to go up from 175 to 180. It's going to cost 200,000 honor badges, but that does not mean nothing since I have over 2 million honor badges. I love saying that every single day. It's going to cost 2 million gold and 320 flames. So let's go ahead and upgrade her real quick. There you go. Beautiful little animation I had going on there. Little spark, little, little, little lust ball that it gave off there. She's now going to be 9 stars. Now, the only evolved hero that's not 9 stars is my druid, but I rarely use my druid i did not use this druid at all maybe this druid will be a little bit more important in the future down the line but i do not use this druid as of right now um let's see we're gonna go ahead and jump into some arena and stuff like that i just want to give you guys a quick look at these evolved heroes just if you guys didn't have a complete understanding of what my heroes are looking like right now all of them are nine stars just take a look at the talents the skills stuff like that um the hero that i'm starting to level up next you guys i can give you a hint I'm going to go really by. I'm going to give you a hint, okay? I'm going to give you a hint. I'm going to give you a hint of the hero I'm going to level up next. Now, I'm, I'm not going to level up the Berserk. Not right now. I might actually level up this Berserk later on down the road. But I'm actually I'm just a little pissed off my Destroyer is not even anywhere near evolved yet. So I do want to evolve this Destroyer. Um, right now, I'm going to put him in there and hear me monsters just sweep, sweep, sweep. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to sweep a lot of dungeons. So if we're going to go here, press sweep, get him in there, just see how many we can sweep. Because you know what? Destroyer is actually really, 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 really nice hero at the end of the day. So I would love to play a little bit more with Destroyer down the road. Let's go ahead and grab this. Let's go ahead and snag this. And might as well, since we are here... Go here, higher heroes, higher with shards, slimes, there you go. Enter, we'll go to, do, 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 who was I giving these? So here's the thing that's been screwing me up, you guys. For the longest time, I was leveling up my Minotaur, right? I was leveling up my Minotaur skill from 7 out of 10 to 8 out of 10. And I'm still going to do it, but I kind of want to level up Destroyer now. Reason being... I, I don't really know, but I just feel like Destroyer is just a really badass hero, and I haven't been using him to his full potential yet, so I want to start using him to his full potential. Let's go ahead and grab these books, all this stuff I could do a little bit later, but yeah, Destroyer, I don't think a lot of people understand. His name is Destroyer for a reason. This guy is absolutely insane. Obviously, he hits slower than fucking a, a stack of bricks. I mean, this guy hits so damn slow. He doesn't move. He's very slow. That's why I have a 5 out of 8 Berserk on him. I might level up that Berserk to like a 6 or a 7. I have no idea. I'm going to have to look more into his skills, his specs, and stuff like that. But Devastation, his skill is going to deal 300% attack to nearby foes and stuns them for 1.5 seconds. 4, 5 seconds boost attack speed by 35% and deflects 35% damage cooldown to 7 seconds. But he has a level 5 life drain. That's probably one of the main reasons why he hits so slow because he has that level 5 life drain. But I feel like I can utilize this hero. I'm going to get his skill up there as well. Maybe to even an 8 out of 10. I want to see what he can really do. I know the cooldown is not going to be able to change, but I do have... A second destroyer right over here so I can actually get this destroyer up there to um, get him evolved so without spending any shards so I think I might put the brakes on that Minotaur I just might put the brakes on that Minotaur because I really do you guys I'm playing this game to have a lot of fun and I want to have fun with that hero so we're we're at 50,000 shards I might drop 50,000 shards into Minotaur and into Destroyer. I don't know. Or maybe all of it into Destroyer. What do you guys think? Put it in the comments below. Minotaur is getting close. Let me show you guys where Minotaur is at right now. Let me give you guys a quick little look-see here. Minotaur is roughly a little bit more than... 
I'll say a little bit more than 200,000. I don't know, you guys. Just tell me what you guys think. You guys think I should finish up Minotaur to 8 out of 10? Or do you guys think I should? Honestly, out of all honesty right now, you guys think I should level up this Destroyer and make this Destroyer one of the most badass Destroyers in the game? Okay, I really don't know. Uh, I know Destroyer is a good hero, so I just want to know your guys' opinion. I'm very curious, actually, to see what crest I have on this Destroyer. I know I don't really mess with Destroyer that much, so I'm not assuming there's going to be a good... Okay, obviously, this Berserk crest means shit since it has that 5 out of 8 Berserk on it. But um, I'm going to have to change that up very soon as well. But yeah, tell me what you guys think. I think Destroyer is an amazing hero, and I think I should start leveling up that Destroyer, definitely. Obviously, a lot of you guys are going to say... Destroyer, a lot of you guys are going to say Minotaur, but I just want to see what you guys will say in the comment section below. Now, I since this Spirit Mage is cool, I want to put that Spirit Mage here. I'm not going to use the Skull Knight right now. I'm going to use this Dredrick. I'm going to go for straight strength right now. I'm going to put this Phantom King in here as well, and I want to see 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I want to see how this Spirit Mage and this Phantom King are going to be working together. Now, this Spirit Mage is a little bit slow, obviously, but I think... I think I can still get this going. The Phantom King is going over there. I see Spirit Mage's proc, and after you see the Spirit Mage proc, you're going to see shortly after, where is... I did not see one Santa Boom proc, not one, and I didn't know, I swear to God, that Ares did not go off not one time at all. I don't know why, that was screwing me up. There's Phantom King, and this, ooh, he's Dredrake. Okay, ooh, okay. I think, let me get this Dread Drake proc real quick. Oh, my Dread Drake went off. There you go. Oh, his Phantom King lowered his Dread Drake. <gasps> I got another, I got two Dread Drake procs. I saw that. My Phantom King got your ass so quick, boy. So quick. That was so clean. Good job, Phantom King. Good job. That is a team player right there. He took off some of the proc of his Dread Drake. And his Dread Drake actually, um, since it was so low, is significantly lower than mine that I got two procs with my Dread Drake. That's a good job. That's why I keep Phantom King in there. He's doing a good job. Oh, uh, let's see. What the fuck? What is all this? I see a 5 out of 5. Revitalize Ares. Oh, my. The only way this is going to be able to work out is my Dread Drake needs to proc right now. Phantom King needs to go as well. His Dread Drake proc'd. His Ares. I took off some of his Ares proc. That's what I need to see. His Ares. No, no, no. Oh, shit. Okay, now it's going to be a war. It's going to be a back and forth war between his Ares and my shit, oh, Spirit Mage Santa Boom, yo, what is good, dude, what is good, you think because you have a Grim Fiend, you think you're all good, no, it's not going to work out for you, Thoris, see, right when I talk shit, right when I start to talk shit, I get someone with this type of might, come on, don't screw me right, oh my god, that is one fast ass lady, Leo, you gotta chill, oh my goodness, jeez, chill, calm down, Oh, his Lady Leo is still going at it, but I think his heroes are low enough for me to come destroy. His Lady Leo is still going. Okay, now just died at the very end. Are we going to get... The big question here, you guys. Are we going to get all five wins in the arena today? Are we going... Why do you have to be an Emperor for? Please, God, do not let me run into this guy. I just want to win all five arena turns without an L, Okay. Okay, I'm not running into him. Oh, uh, does he have a Dread Drake? He does have a Dread Drake. That's fine. He can have a Dread Drake at the end of the day. But I want to win all five arena turns. I do not want to lose with an L. I don't want an L. I took out some of his Ares. Oh my god, his Ares is going away. Dude, Phantom King is so raw in the arena. You guys have to understand that. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, wait. He's still he's still going, bro. Chill. He's still going. Oh, I got to catch up. I, yeah, you go. Catch up. The, there you go. All five arena wins okay i used to take l's okay but i don't take l's no more i try not to take any l's yesterday's video i had to end the video on a losing streak but today i can end the video on a very 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 happy streak i guess whatever doesn't really matter anyways you guys hope you enjoyed this video uh tell me what you guys think about the destroyer and the minotaur skill leveling up what do you guys think in the comment section below as basically i hope you guys enjoyed the video do not forget to like and subscribe and i will see you guys all in the next one bye and have an extremely nice day you guys Blackout.